Hi and welcome everyone. My name is David and I'm head of product here at Sablono. Today I want to show you the activity tracker page. We have been working on this page on and off for about a year and I feel like the current version includes all the features that it needs to replace your existing exit tracker and actually takes them one step further. But let me show you how it looks. You can exit it, exit it after opening your project and then navigating to the activity tracker page. Once you're there, you will have to select the work package that you want to focus on. In this case, we have the facade installation package and the apartment fitout available for us, but we'll focus on the apartment fitout for now. After selecting it, you will find your activities and the responsible teams on top and your work areas on the left side of your screen. Notice that work areas are presented um, summarized by project structure at the beginning, but you can always expand and look at the individual deliverables, in this case, apartments, if you choose to do so. This will highlight you the status of all of these areas across all of your deliverables. What you can see in the matrix is first, um, as a background color, the activity status. Uh, green means it's finished and confirmed. Blue means started. Red crossed means rejected, for example. <clears throat> Furthermore, you will see as, as those numbers here, um, how many issues are reported on a certain activity. In this example, you can see in the background that the activity had been rejected and there's currently one quality issue, which is reported on this. You will also notice that there's three different drop lines here. Red indicates which activities should be done until today. So actually all of the boxes on the left of this should be green by now. Orange indicates what should be done until the end of this week. And yellow indicates what should be done until the end of next week. If you want to choose a, a focus on your dates, you can choose the show dates mode. And if you choose to do so, you will see baseline look ahead and end dates across all activities for all of your areas. But for the purpose of this video, let's go back to show issues. As you can see, this gives you quite a good overview about the current status of your project. You can see level one is already up until here. Um, level two is also started already in level three, even though it wasn't planned to start yet. The ME team decided to start on these activities already. There's numerous filters on this page. You can, for example, select a specific team that you want to focus on. So this could be the case if you're responsible for dry lining, either as a manager or as a part of that team, you would select to see only activities related to that team. And then the view is filtered down to that. You could also focus on areas which have been rejected if you wanted to know where to focus your attention on next. Um, and this will bring you up only the apartments which have rejected activities that Team Drylining is actually responsible for. All in all, we believe that this page is a perfect tool for you and your team to understand the current status of the project. I hope that by now you already saw some advantages of this um, against your Excel trackers. Nevertheless, let me double down on that a bit. I think um, from my perspective, the biggest advantage of this over Excel is that everything that you see here is actually directly connected to the very powerful progress data of Sablonus database. That means you will not update this manually on your own. Um, this is auto updated whenever somebody off the team reported progress from site using the mobile application. In most cases, that progress report is then actually also confirmed by management. So you can really trust the data that you see here. We believe that because of this, you will be able to finally get rid of the numerous disconnected exit trackers that sit in your, in your drives. And for the very first time, you will be able to rely on a single source of truth for project status looking at this page. That's all that I wanted to show today. As always, please share any feedback that you have with us. We will continue to work on this and include whatever we feel makes or adds a lot of value to the page. For now, happy tracking and see you next time.